I'm Joe Kirshner with American Water College. Watch as I use my five-step approach to solve this problem. This next unit conversion problem reads, convert 1.37 million gallons per day to gallons per minute. So we're looking for gallons per minute. They gave us the flow of 1.378 MGD. And now we're going to go ahead and convert that. Now there's an equivalent that says one day is equivalent to 1440 minutes or 1440 minutes in one day. So we'll solve this problem using this equivalent. And then I'll show you another way to solve this problem. So we're going to skip right to step five. And we start with our 1.378 MGD. But notice how I wrote it. I wrote it out long form, 1,378,000 gallons per day. And this is what we need to do if we want to use this equivalent of 1440 minutes in one day. Okay, we need to make sure that we expand this out, this MGD, expand it out to 1,378,000 gallons per day. And then we can enter our equivalent of one day is equivalent to 1,440 minutes. And that allows our days to divide out, and we're left with gallons on top and minutes on the bottom, or gallons per minute. So when we divide that out, we come up with 957 gallons per minute. Well, let me show you another way to solve this with a different equivalent that's worth remembering. Okay, here we have the same information, same flow. We're looking for gallons per minute. But instead of 1440, I'm going to use the equivalent that says 1 MGD is equivalent, or it's the same as, 694.4 gallons per minute. Now this is something that's really worth remembering to convert between gallons per minute and MGD and then the other way as well. So again, we're going to go to step five. So here we can just enter our flow as given, 1.378. We just put that right here. And then we load this equivalent in. And since we have MGD on top, we're going to put the 1 MGD on the bottom and the gallons per minute on top. So in this case, we're going to multiply across. You can see our MGD divide out. We're going to multiply 1.378 times 694.4. And that gives us that same answer of 957 gallons per minute. So I'm going to leave it up to you which way you want to do this problem. But as you get up into the higher levels and higher levels of math, this method right here and using the 694.4 gallons per minute is equivalent to 1 MGD, this will be helpful. So I wanted you to see that now. If you need additional help preparing for a state license exam, click the link below and we'll get you some more information about our license-specific exam prep courses.